Officials with the U.S. Department of Defense now are preparing to implement a change to protect new military personnel from brain damage. And that's something members of Maine's congressional delegation have been pushing for since the Lewiston mass shooting. A memo sent out last week by the Deputy Secretary of Defense states new recruits will soon be required to undergo cognitive screenings to monitor brain function. The same test will be done for high risk personnel likely exposed to blasts within the first year. This comes after a study performed on the brain of the Lewiston shooter Robert Card. It suggested he had significant brain damage that could have been caused by explosions from his work in the Army Reserve. The scans will allow military doctors to track any possible brain damage in personnel moving forward.